Well, our shit is kind of in shambles right now, to say the least. We still need to secure that leg over there on the bunk bed to the floor, which we have not done. And then we gotta get in here. And man, you cannot see in here. But we'll see what we can do. So anyways, the AC board and that inverter has gone out. So we ordered a new AC board, but now we have to get it out of there. So we're going to have to relocate this heater vent and this uh, uh, pressure regulator thingy, accumulator. <sighs> and I think we might have to get into the electronics too. We'll see. I'm not sure, but it's, it's a bad job. It's a bad job. And also, up here we have a backup power inverter and battery charger that we're going to install on this wooden deck. So after we get that one out and back in and repaired, we're going to install a backup here so that when the power goes out again from the heat, we have another inverter that we can just switch over to because uh, the heat is getting really bad in the world and uh, yeah, it's not great. but. We want to try to keep our original inverter because we got our generator starter stuff in there. So we want to keep that there. And we got our heater right here, which is 12 volt. We'll figure it all out, I guess. I don't want to heat it because I got to take this apart. Thankfully, we got lots of Toyota coolant, so. Generator sounds weak. We'll give it a couple of tries. It needs to charge the battery. Uh, here's our heat exchanger. It's all good, but we do need to go back in there. Let's see, get this light. And uh, we got a leak, kind of, sort of, on that reservoir. And also, it's just kind of, like, bendy. So, we want to get that all situated. And there's our sink. We have it disconnected right now uh, because we're going to be working in here. 